Okay. Um, quick sound check. All good. Okay, uh, thanks everyone for coming. Uh, my name's Alistair De Silva. I'm uh, one of the uh, developers at IBM's Auslabs. Um, uh, so one of the things we do at work is um, we are doing the Linux port for the Power9 chips that you was uh, passing around um, this morning. Um, have a couple of my colleagues here helping me out. Uh, we have uh, Leonard Lowe um, just helping uh, with packing and uh, Daniel Black's going to be helping during the workshop itself. If anyone has any troubles, either grab myself or Daniel and we'll try and help you out. So um, if you haven't already, please clone the Git repository and start reading through the prerequisites. There's really important information in there that will help you through the last section of the workshop. Um, there's some basic fundamental understanding you need about the OneWire protocol. Um, and also there's a little bit of basic setup you need to do um, to get your embed environment set up for programming the microcontroller. So, um, this workshop is all about logic analyzers. Um, so about a year and a half ago, I started developing my own home automation system based on one wire. And I came across a weird bug where my devices would not enumerate on the bus if I had another device connected. And it stumped me for about two months and I was poring over the software going, what's wrong? Why isn't this working? It looks like it should work. And eventually I decided I'd bite the bullet and get myself a logic an analyzer and see what was going on on the wire. And within about two hours I had identified the problem, fixed it, and was able to actually complete the project. Um, so that kind of led me to this workshop and I thought I would share my knowledge uh, with everyone here. Um, so that um, as you guys progress in your uh, embedded adventures, when you run into trouble you'll have the right tools to um, to solve your own problems. So uh, we'll be using a package called SIGROC. Um, there's a screenshot of one of its front ends up there at the moment. Um, so basically what a logic analyzer is, is it's a device that lets you look at the data signals going on um, electrically um, between devices. Uh, so in this case we're looking at an I2C communication uh, between a microcontroller and I can't make out what that is. It's uh, probably some memory device, I think. Um, ah, thanks. Um, so, uh, yeah, what, um, what we can do there, you can see there's two lower traces, which are the raw electrical signals that are going on. And then the upper traces are various stages of decoding that information to make it a little bit easier for you to understand what's going on. Um, your kit's going to contain a microcontroller board. Should look like that, uh, with headers soldered on, so you can plug it straight into your breadboard. Um, it's a uh, STM32 based uh, microcontroller. For some of you, this might be your first experience with ARM. Don't let it daunt you. Um, we've got instructions that'll walk you through how to program it and get everything set up. And, oops. And, uh, yeah, so that is about it for the briefing. Um, so if you guys want, um, please feel free to um, get started on the first exercise. Um, if you need any assistance, just wave your hand, shout out. Um, either myself or Daniel will be around to help you.